Hey everyone, welcome back to John's Watch. Today I'm taking a look at a visual novel game called Saint Maker. This game was released on Steam on February 22nd, 2023. I'm really sorry, I'm only just getting to it now. Its regular price is $17.99 Canadian or a regional equivalent, and it's developed and published by Yang Yang Mobile. They also did another visual novel called The Letter, which was a very spooky and, and very good visual novel. This is another horror visual novel. Honestly, at this point, I should have held off on doing this video uh, until like October, because I'm already very late to it. Uh, apologies again. <laughs> it looks like there is voice acting in the game. So we've got all our voice sliders great right there, which is excellent. Let's check it out. <gasps> My god, the statue is bleeding. That's very spooky. Somewhere in the forest is a stream. The letter was like actually very spooky. Maybe a flower bed and a grove full of old trees, like the ones in storybooks. Fairies darting in and out of knot holes. Oh, maybe it won't be so spooky. That would be great. Focus, Holly. Get your head out of the clouds. Yeah, Holly. I'm not here for that. Ah, some nice animation as well. It's, you know, got some particle effects going on. It's very nice. Some storybook. Fairies? They aren't real. It's like what Mom always said. There are only angels and demons. Oh God. It's a bit defeatist, Holly. Come now. Ah, a spooky abandoned church, possibly. Doors open. I forgot, I forgot to read. Hello? <laughs> Excuse me, is anyone here? I forgot to read the unvoiced bits. Maybe the whole thing got cancelled. Whoopsie. <laughs> That'd be nice. I'll have the whole place to myself. Heh. All the mysterious adventures I could get into, alone in an abandoned convent. No parents. No adults. Just me and demons. <laughs> Is that Amazing Grace? <laughs> oh, that must be them. Don't know if that is Amazing Grace, actually. It sounds like it. Well, so much for that fantasy. God, this this is going to be like pretty spooky when like I don't know it gets to nighttime or something. Like it looks quite bright right now, which is nice. It's coming from further in. Hello. Oh. I probably shouldn't disturb them. Heard that some nuns, nuns spend their entire lives singing prayers. Prayers for God, prayers for the world, for the sinners. Though, sounds like it'd get boring after a while. It does, a little bit. <laughs> but, well, it's, it's for a good cause. Our order's sacred mission and all that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello. Shush, lower your voice. It's ill manners to disturb prayer. Okay. I love the animation. Just, you know, subtle, but it's nice, you know. Makes makes it feel a little bit more interesting. Uh, oh, sorry. I do wish you could get rid of this in the bottom corner. I don't know why that needs to be there. <laughs> like, that's good to have on, like, the title menu. <laughs> Is it debug info? <laughs> I don't think so. I didn't apply that either. Oh, there's, there's our debug info. That's interesting. <laughs> Current scene number. Scene zero. That's cool. So you can make that appear, but you can't get rid of that at the bottom. I, yeah, I don't need that in here, you know? Where the hell did she come from? Okay, just chill out, Holly. It's just a nun. <laughs> Is everything all right? You were talking to yourself. I'm a visual novel character. That's what we do. Huh? I didn't notice. <laughs> Right, I do that too. Oh god. <laughs> that was that probably came out creepier than you wanted it to, sneaky nun. This place has a very special air to it. It's hard not to get caught up in my own thoughts sometimes. Voice acting, solid, really good. Um, yeah. I got to say this place it's bigger than I expected. Holly does sound like the the love fairy from Honey Pop though. <laughs> Oh yes, used to get lost all the time. I still do, to be honest. <laughs> and here I am, chattering away again. How can I help you? I'm 
here for the recollection? Oh, yes, yes, of course! Oh, you're looking for our dearest and most admirable Mother Superior. Down the hallway, third room to the left. Probably in the middle of one of her stunning lectures. Sounds great. I see. Uh, thank you very much. And, um, sorry again for disturbing you. Oh, please. I'm here to help. By all means, feel free to disturb me anytime. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Uh. <sighs> They're getting younger every year. Huh? Oh, nothing. It's always good to start early. Anyway, I hope you enjoy your stay here. I sure hope you don't human sacrifice me or anything. Yeah. Sure. Th thank you. Hmm. Hmm. I'm 15. I'm not that young. Maybe it was that stupid little scream I made. <laughs> nice job, Holly. Looking real composed back there. Is this the place? Huh? There's a lot of statues. Whoa. Looks like someone's been trying to put it back together piece by piece. Must have taken a lot of work. Though, still doesn't look right. Careful, plaster's still fresh on that one. Just one touch can bend the whole thing out of shape. <laughs> Our most venerable founder was particularly fond of this one. Saint Rita of Cassia. Are you familiar? No. Born 1381, died in 1457. Patron saint of lost and impossible causes. Sorry, I was familiar, actually. Um, yes, a bit. At the age of 12, she married into an abusive family. Regrettably, her two sons grew up to take after their father. Violent. Vengeful. And so, she prayed to God to save their souls. And so, God answered. They died of disease soon after. A harsh lesson but an important one to take to heart. God works in mysterious ways. Even death can sometimes be a mercy. I... I see. Oh, but enough of that. You've yet to introduce yourself. Uh, oh, hello there. I'm Holly Beltron. Oh, yes, Miss Holly. I've been expecting you, though I don't recall receiving you. Huh? Oh, I'm so sorry, I, I knocked, but no one came. But I did meet a very sneaky nun. Sneaky nun? Yes, it was sneaky, not creepy. She was creepy, but... And so you chose to trespass instead? What? No, I didn't mean to. I was just... Give whatever name you want to your sin, Miss Holly. It is still a sin, nonetheless. Whoa, is trespassing really a sin? I think it's a crime, but is every crime a sin? Got to think about that. Your bags. Kindly lay them down. My bags? Oh, you'd be surprised the things that we find. Cigarettes, contraceptives, pornography. Can you imagine bringing such things into the house of God? Astounding. That is astounding. Mm, that's horrible. I should have covered it. Or at least kept it in a hidden pocket. My pornography. <laughs> Not that my bag has any. Hmm, well, what do we have here? I knew it. Why'd I even bring that stupid thing? Kylie Taylor, the sorceress of Witchwood. Witchwood witches? That will not do. Uh, that's just something I'm reading. Oh, yes, well, it is always good to read. We only read one book here, though, Ollie. I myself simply love books. Books can enrich, they can teach, but when observing a work, never forget to take spirituality into account, especially when it comes to material written for young, impressionable minds. Hmm. And there it was, cradled just beneath the canopy of elder trees, candlelight pouring from the notched windows, and the sound of laughter echoing from within. This was her new home. It was here that she would learn magic. Magic? You're a witch. Burnt at the stake. Magic. Such an innocent sounding word. But, dear child, there are no greys when it comes to witchcraft. All of it, black as sin. 
A proper child of God would know this. Oof. It's... All right, calm down. You can do this. You've always been good at this. <gasps> we got a choice. Uh, tell her what she wants to hear. You're absolutely right. Hmm? I noticed something was off as soon as I started reading it. And still you kept it. Stubbornness on my part. I spent a good chunk of my allowance on it, so I was hoping I could return it. But even so, I really should be more mindful when it comes to these things. I like that it's choices. I, th I think the letter was mostly kinetic. I don't fully remember. I don't think I finished it. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm glad there's choices in this. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I realize I'm not making a very good first impression. I've been looking forward to this for weeks. I guess I've been so excited that I've just been all over the place lately. Moving forward, I'll try my best to improve. I'm sorry. <sighs> oh, improvement. There you go. That is one thing that we, the sisters of Saint Idolora, hold very dear. For Saint Rita's children, death was their only salvation. But for those willing to fix themselves, well, you'll find that this convent is the perfect place for spiritual rebirth. Nice, might not even need to die. Here, you can be anyone you want to be. <laughs> but not a witch, obviously. Anyone I want to be. Y yes I understand. That, that sounds great. I'd like that. Well, now that we've settled that, let's start things off the right way. I am Sister Adira, and I will be in charge of your spiritual formation for the next few weeks. It's very nice to meet you, Sister Adira. There. That wasn't so hard now, was it? And as for your book, I think it's best that I keep it. She's a big fan of the, the Witchwood series of books, I'm sure. But... But she can't just take it. Uh, I think it's probably better just to let it go. Yeah. There's no use arguing. Better just let the whole thing go. Um, it's nothing. Never mind. Hmm. Miss Holly, I take it you're an avid reader? Yes, ma'am. Then that also means you enjoy writing, yes? Y yes I guess. Now write, what, like 50 lines on the sin you've committed by reading about witches. At least I didn't bring any of my fanfics. You'd have a field day with those. Oh, wait here for just a moment. This should suit you just fine. A prayer journal for teens. Pray with style. There's prayers at the end of every page. A journal. Time has a funny way of muddling memory. It helps to have an anchor. That way we can always look back and see the old with new, fresh eyes. This next week will be integral to your spiritual formation. It would be best to keep a record of your thoughts. As we've discussed, not all stories are worth reading. But if you keep your heart open, there's definitely a story for you here. A story of your own personal journey with God. Well, that sounds nice. Can I trust you to do that? Yes, ma'am. And thank you, Sister Adira. Please call me Sister Adira. For our time together, I'd like to think of us as family. I just noticed that it says on the store page that it's unsupported on Steam Deck. I feel like it probably works fine on Steam Deck. Like, I haven't tested it, but I think this is just in Rempi. Rempi? Rempi? Um, so like it's probably not officially supported, but I imagine it would work fine. Family. Like I needed more of that. Now, come this way. I'll show you to your room. Like pretty much every visual novel, I think except for one visual novel, uh, every single one has worked fine on the Steam Deck. Yes, ma'am. Uh, uh, sister Adira. <laughs> Kylie Taylor and the Sorceress of Witchwood. Notes all over the margins. Letter on the first page. Pink ink. Strawberry scent. Limited edition cover. Signed. I'm never seeing it again. God damn it. You probably should have thought before you brought it, I guess. It's fine, Holly. Relax. This is for the best. You're not here for that. You're here to be better. 
Why is she here, though? Hmm. Ah, Gabriella. Oh, Gabriella. This is Holly. She will also be joining us for the recollection. Hey there. Just call me Gabby. Gabriella is your God-given name. <laughs> it's a name you were born with. And I happen to think it's quite lovely. Be proud of it. Abbreviations tend to only confuse. Right. No nicknames allowed. That's news to me. And I hope it's news you take to heart. We do, after all, have rules here, Miss Gabriella. <laughs> There's an excessive amount of statues in this place. Yeah. Sure. Oh boy. Well, we're off to a good start. Okay, just do what you do best, Holly. You know the drill. Uh, yeah, that Hello one. There. Pleased to meet you. My name's Holly, and for the record, I think Gabrielle is a pretty cool name. She's like just gonna stare at me. Had a classmate named Gabriella. Really smart. Ran for the student council. Though now that I think about it, she might have lost. It was close, though. She's gonna continue staring. Good to know. Oh, she didn't. <laughs> Oh, um, are we the first ones to arrive? To think that I was worried I might have been late. As of now, Miss Holly, we are complete. The recollection will start first thing in- Wait, seriously? There's only two of us. I think, I think there is only two. Wait, there's others. <laughs> yes, sadly, as of late, attendance has been quite low. Can't imagine why. There she goes again. Is she for real? Like, real subtle, girl. Oh, I think you know the answer, Gabriella. <sighs> distractions. So many distractions we're letting into our lives. And even in these trying times, we still take for granted God's loving grace. You two, however, are very fortunate that your parents were responsible enough to take an active role in your formation. Yeah, sure. Um... That's true, Miss uh, Sister Adira. I believe these few weeks will be an enlightening experience for all of us. Well, I'm so glad to hear that, child. Recollections like these are a very special opportunity, and I hope that both of you will be wise enough to seize it. Yeah, I'm already feeling God's almighty wisdom. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, say that a bit louder, why don't you? I will give you the rest of the day to settle in. We shall start first thing tomorrow. I imagine we'll probably have to go, like, decently far into the game to get to the horror stuff. But I'm gonna try- I'm, I'm gonna try and get something spooky in here, you know? But until then, I urge you both to take in the silence this place has to offer. Reflect. Pray. I guess this is my bed for the next few days. I should start unpacking too. Not the nicest looking place. But maybe if I fix it up a bit. There we go, looking better already. A little corner to call my own. Been a while since I've shared a room with someone. Been even longer since I've slept in a room that wasn't my own. It all feels so familiar. Maybe a bit too familiar. <laughs> yeah, I think that's better for now. <laughs> what else do I have here? A story of my own, huh? Hopes and wishes. I really wish I had my book. Would be nice getting lost in the pages. The turn of a spell key, a heartfelt secret and a little push. That's all it takes to get to the mysterious world of Witchwood. <laughs> this is a prayer journal, Holly. That's right. This won't do it all. I'm supposed to be talking to God. Focus, Holly. To my dearest Heavenly Father. Well, here I am. I wonder what we'll be up to tomorrow. Whatever it is, I'm sure you'll be with me every step of the way. We started off a bit rough, but I'm optimistic for the wonderful journey ahead. Amen. <gasps> An achievement. You can actually see the top one. You couldn't see the actual Steam one, but... Okay, we might get something spooky here tonight. There's a good chance. Hey, Holly! Huh? Liana? 
What are you doing? Or we'll just get a flashback. But it might still lead to something spooky. Uh, I... I can't sleep. That's not my problem. Huh, I can fix that. Behold my special move! Whoa. Whoa! Yana! Okay, okay, I'm up. Haha! <laughs> Mission accomplished. Ugh, Yana. Huh? What's that you got there? Just a book. Wanna see it? Oh, wow. I don't remember Mom buying this. She didn't. No, he lent it to me. Pretty cool, huh? See? Her name's Kylie. She's strong and brave. Just like someone else I know. Huh? You really think so? Nah, just trying to get on your good side. Right. Oh, oh, but here's the coolest part. She's... She's a witch. I think I think that was probably obvious from the, the front cover. <laughs> uh, what? Liana, you know how mom gets... Remember what happened when you brought home that toy devil -y? Dragon. It was a dragon. It's not my fault mom wasn't listening. And she's still not going to listen if she finds something like this. Look, Liana, you need to stop getting yourself in trouble. Don't worry so much. I'll just hide it in a place she'll never find. But... <sighs> just give it back as soon as you can. Well, about that... You see, I was, um, thinking maybe we could read it together, just like how we used to. Really? Y yeah, but if you don't want to... No, it's... Okay, sure, we can read it, but only because the cover looks cool. Come on over here. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Hmm. The whispering forest. The sky was a muddy brown. As brown and muddy as the grounds around St. Mary's Orphanage. Despite this, Kylie was determined to give her little sister Farley the best birthday ever. Good for Kylie. Oh, Kylie has a sister? I is that her picture? I like her. She's mine. I'm doing her voice. <laughs> you don't even know her yet. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I got this feeling. <gasps> <gasps> Whoa. Uh Mom, Holly, hide the book. Shh, quiet. Just stay still. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> that was pretty spooky. Can't move. Oh no. I can't move. It's okay. This is fine. I'm just stuck in between sleeping and waking up. Just breathe, Holly. Breathe. Whoa. Uh -oh. I think those statues are looking at her. That sound. Relax, it's just singing. Just prayers. Sounds kind of nice, right? Like a lullaby. Just close your eyes and go back to sleep, Holly. Just relax. You're just hearing things. Maybe she was. No white walls, no flower curtains. No mom, no Liana. You're not home. Get a grip, Holly. New place, new day, new you. You've got this. Remember, no distractions. Okay, well, I think that's probably the spookiest we're going to get in the first, like, 40 minutes. And I've already been recording for 30 minutes, so I think that's going to have to do for the video. Um, we got a little bit of a hint at, at, at some of the spooky stuff. I think it'll probably get spookier. And we'll definitely get more of her backstory. Um, I think this is very intriguing so far. Um, I hope it works on Steam Deck, because, you know, I might, I might play it on Steam Deck in a few months, when it's a bit closer to Halloween or something like that. I think that'd be pretty cool. Uh, yeah, solid voice acting. Gabriella's not great, um, but everyone else is very good. It's all voiced. That's really impressive. It's very reasonably priced. Uh, I'll see if I can find something about how long it is. Oh, the, the store page description says it itself. It's got a, it's, it's around 60,000 words. 
and four to six hours of estimated gameplay. Um, so like this first 30 minutes um, is probably not actually 30 minutes of that four to six hours because I you know, have to read it all aloud so it takes a bit longer. Um, so yeah, there's still still a decent amount. I, I think I think that's a well well priced for being fully voiced and four to six hours. That, that sounds very reasonable to me. There you go, that was a look at Saint Maker. Thank you guys very much for watching. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.